Well, I mean, it doesn't look like much now, but this is going to be uh, really a state-of-the-art facility that's going to draw national attention for Marquette University. I mean, we see this facility as setting the standard for um, athletic performance research. And I think our, the faculty between uh, the two colleges of engineering and health sciences are enormously excited about uh, the potentiality here to, to do just that. Our faculty already work together and the creation of such a facility gives us um, new opportunities that we haven't seen before and also the opportunity to attract experts from really all over the world to do their science and to look at rehabilitation in high performance athletes. This will be a way to not only promote uh, the science of health and wellness but also uh, to take a major step forward in learning more about injury prevention not only among elite athletes but but all of us. This will be really at the forefront of understanding uh, the science behind uh, athletic performance. Okay, arms up, ready, set, go. So today we had some of the men's basketball players come in for some force plate testing. Where they come into our lab and perform a couple different jumps for us and we're able to analyze their force and power outputs. So the testing part of what we're doing is definitely becoming more and more important uh, because we kind of go by the maxim that you can't manage what you don't measure. And so if we want to measure performance, accumulated fatigue, risk of injury, we need to have numbers to do that. Uh, being a better athlete is huge. It's, it's another half of a game and we're, we're working with Todd every day just to be more explosive, uh, to be stronger and just quicker every day. And so it's a huge part of the game. We have elite scientists on this campus and this building will be able to merge the two. Uh, you know, the academic side will come together, the athletic side will all be in the building, and our elite athletes will really benefit from the, uh, the, the scientific research that's going on around the subject of athletic performance, human performance. So it's really a great opportunity for our athletes to get better. It's also a great opportunity for us to recruit student athletes to Marquette because we're going to be able to show them uh, the kinds of expertise that they're going to benefit from while they're here. Some of the very exciting pieces about this are um, having a new facility to do a lot of our testing in. We're kind of confined by space at the moment and being able to do the testing in a facility that offers us the ability to do it on field, on court, on the track as opposed to in a small lab space. That will be very um, exciting to us. I do think it will attract the best and the brightest to Milwaukee. Uh, cause others to want to stay here. I hope maybe some of our own uh, students coming out of the right disciplines, it will provide a great opportunity for them to maybe think about staying in Milwaukee. Uh, I think it will totally transform the corridor where it exists and, and just provide another vibrant area of downtown Milwaukee that I think is good for everybody. You know, research is really core to what we do as a university. Universities are about discovering knowledge and disseminating knowledge. And it is that research that uh, changes the way we educate, it informs the way we teach, it is what allows us to really solve real world problems, it is what allows us to attract outstanding faculty and students to campus. Uh, it really is what allows us to make a difference. So uh, the ability to have something, a new facility like this, and new programs to um, really elevate our research program is really important to Marquette. And uh, we see this as uh, making a name for Marquette on a national uh, level. Uh, in terms of bringing in coaches, bringing in uh, athletic trainers, bringing in uh, people from the discipline uh, to learn uh, from us since it will be uh, a cutting-edge state-of-the-art facility.